So my name is Meltem and I'm 23 years old. Uh, I'm chemistry teacher in Turkey. I'm from Turkey. Yeah, I finished university and one year later I came here. And I'm here, I'm in Greece six on six and a half months. And I'm working in youth center here. Uh, my cousin, she was so interested with Erasmus, Erasmus projects and volunteering. So she went to a project in Romania. And yeah, I heard from her and I applied to Greece, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, I was working as a volunteer even in my country, um, in organization, uh, Genç Academy. And yeah, uh, with them I applied. And it's like basically like, Okay, I'm gonna talk about hypotherapy more. So hypotherapy is basically like some ch children who has disability. We are making therapy, we are doing therapy with horse to them. So yeah, I was working there and like I was helping to the coordinator and like the owner of organization. I realized that I, I need more things than being a chemistry teacher. And then I was thinking opportunities and I always wanted to go abroad. So that's why I changed my mind and I saw Youth Center project. Actually, I was waiting another project to be honest. And then I saw this project and I was more interested with this project. Uh, my Turkish organization actually, they um, suggest me this organization. So I didn't know any English. I mean, of course, I know, I knew some basic things, but it wasn't enough for communication. Of course, this was my big problem when I came here. Normally, I'm not a shy person at all, but almost first one month, I was feeling shy. Yeah, I was studying, actually. Like, I can say that I really faced with it. I have a, a memory about it, like one day I was in my room, I was new here and like, I needed a scissors mm -hmm. and I couldn't even ask, I was feeling so shy and I said okay keep calm, I was so anxious, I said okay keep calm, you can use your Google Translate, yeah so it was so hard first time and I said to myself you have to do it, you came here, you decided for this, mm -hmm. I was writing every word the whole day like to my phone to my walls to my notebook and now um, I think one or two weeks ago okay I don't remember when <laughs> I was looking them and like I said them, oh my goodness they are super easy words how you didn't know them so I had to learn I learned thankfully <laughs> like basically everyone is working in the mornings and I'm working in the evenings so I'm a bit sleepy in this home about my daily routine like basic things like cooking cleaning with other volunteers everything is like we have some schedule about like cleaning and everyone has their own uh, food uh, schedule but sometimes we are eating together and it's also made make me feel like we are family we are eating all together and i feel good and I'm working in youth center in the evenings, but sometimes I'm going to office of Orca Orpheus organization. I'm going sometimes when they need help, when we have workshop, Greek lessons, I'm going. Here is, yes, a bit small, uh, but it's also making us feel like comfort zone because we can go everywhere by walk. We can do whatever we want, like if you feel even depressed, you can in two minutes, you can go to see. But for weekends, we are going usually to the other cities like Patra, Athens, other towns like Calavrita. And it's nice. It's also make, I mean, living together, I think it's making me feel here like family. And we are also taking care of each other. So I feel nice here. I'm working in youth center and here is basically like kindergarten, like second kindergarten. Mostly children are going during the day their kindergarten as a school and then they are coming here for some more activities, some scientific activities, some craft activities, some games, some music, dance activities together. And not just this, like for example now we are going to Christmas and we are having Christmas decoration 
Uh, I'm helping to teachers about decorations. And like when we were going to summer, when we were going to winter, always we are changing decorations. And sometimes teachers, if teachers needs another things, also we are helping them. Uh, the age starting from 5, 6 to 12. I'm working here from uh, 4 to 8 uh, in the evening. Uh, it's also these hours very useful for the parents because they can bring their children to take from school and come in here and they are also working. So it's very useful for them. Yeah, just now actually, before you come in, we were talking with another volunteer and I told him that I'm not the same person at all before Greece and after Greece. Greece. Yeah, I got many skills here. Like when I came here, I remember I even couldn't cut properly some crafts, but now I'm, I feel that I'm expert. <laughs> not just this, like I learned everything. Now I think I'm in a more, um, good communication with children and I'm more uh, patient. Yes, yeah, sometimes I'm more uh, calm to them and sometimes I have to tell and I have to explain and especially who knows English, we are more good communication with them because I can explain why it's correct what they do and why it's incorrect what they do. Um, yeah, I think I learned here more than English, like I learned control myself because sometimes something is really not going well and I have to say myself okay keep calm you don't have to be angry you can do it again it, it here gave me many skills I really believe this yeah I think this program gave me so much opportunities even just in my mind it changed my mind let's say so I started work here and I really like to work with children in kindergarten in some crash like youth center so i really realized that i love uh, being here uh, spend my time with them work with them but i said how i can go uh, how i can be a kindergarten teacher i said myself and uh, you know as a chemistry teacher i'm not useful for children yeah i can have some experiments with them but that's all so I started an education. It's a certificate, worldwide known certificate. It's about teaching English. So if I get this certificate, I think I can work in those places, kindergarten, crash or what else. And you know that I told you before, like I didn't know any English and I came here and I learned. Now I'm learning how I can teach English. So it's very, I, I feel proud of myself. Yes, not just Turkish people. I recommend everyone and I actually I'm doing like everyone is asking me what are you doing, doing in Greece, how it's going on, how it's going your project and I'm telling everyone, everyone should try this program because why not? It's an opportunity they gave us so we should use, we are still so young, we can improve, not, like, not just language, it's completely changing you and you are not same person before those programs and after those programs. It's also uh, about your uh, um, organization because some people they have bad experience unfortunately but me, my organization, my workplace, I think I'm so lucky to because I'm here, I'm so lucky for this. Yeah.